Hello wood turners and makers and welcome back to my channel It's not going to be a project this week It is going to be an unboxing uh, I had a great surprise when I got home from work the other day uh, I was inting out for my birthday I would love a new mini life uh, So my two daughters got together and brought me the new Draper Mini Lathe, which will go with my big Draper. So, this video is going to be the unboxing and having a look at this lathe. So, I'm not going to go through opening it and unboxing it all, I'm just going to do it, get it over there, and then we'll have a look at it. I'll see it in a minute. Okay then, this is the live out of the box. So, what can I say about it? I'll put you around the other side and then we'll have a little talk about it and see how good. We'll, we'll do a little test on it. Test the uh, speed and, and what not. So I'll speak to you in a minute. Okay then. So, the actual cost of this lathe, believe it or not, was £170 for this lathe, under £200. So, it's uh, really quietly built. These on the ends here, these used to be plastic, but then now they've improved that. So if it's cast or cast iron or something, but they've really improved on that now. Quite nice. Yeah, right. Uh, what have we got with it? The speed on it is seven fifty to three thousand two hundred RPM, which is it's quite quick. That is for a little mini lathe. That ain't too bad. Uh, the weight of it is 21 kilograms, so yeah, and it's quite an, an heavy little lathe. So, what do you get with it? You get a fairly decent size face plate with it, and also you get a nice little face plate. You get two tool rests. Oh. And also, you get these as well. So, right. Why I was chuffed that they got me the uh, trap alive is because the thread on that is 16 TPI, which my truck chucks fit on it. So I was quite chuffed with that because a lot of my stuff for that, the big driver, will fit on this. Right, what else? Okay, let's have a look. Oh, it's the banjo. It's quite runs quite nice. Got a steady once it's fastened down. Oh dear. Yeah, that's quite good. See how it lines up. Lines up quite well with that. Can you see it? Lines up quite well, doesn't it? So, yeah, I'm actually really chuffed 
But this, uh, it was, like I says, it, uh, it is a birthday present of my two daughters. Uh, so I was really out of the moon when I got back from work and seen it there. And uh, couldn't wait to get down here, get it unboxed and throw it to you. Lock uh, says it's a, a nice small lathe uh, for a draper. So, I only wanted four, like I said, pen turning and little jewellery boxes and stuff like that. So I keep using the, uh, the big, because this is a dry alive as well. So, uh, I'm just showing you what the dry lives are like. Uh, you know, there's loads of other different brands out there, different, you know. So, it's entirely yourselves which one. I'm just showing you what the Draper Mini Live is like. Uh, one thing I do really like about this is, let me get you closer so you can see. What I like is, got a nice soft start when you press the button it doesn't kick straight in on the big lathe and you've got like a little knob here to control your speed so I'm quite really tough with that with that part of it Uh, you get also a little knocking bar which goes both ends because we do know how these get can get pretty stuck in there and also pretty soy so you get that as well quite chuffed with these guys because like I say this does fit the bath lives and I've got loads of other ones as well and loads of different bits for it to go on I know it's not the best of reviews on a live I'm just showing you this live that I've had and I am out of the moment with it and chuffed for a nice little live uh, so you know, I'll, uh, I'll leave a few details up of, of this live. Where you can, uh, this was actually brought off eBay. Uh, they, they ordered it on the, on a Monday and within two days it was here. Uh, for £170 delivered. Uh, you can't mount at that. And Log says, uh, I was quite chuffed that it was the driver. Because, like I said, I've got the big drape alive and I've got this one there. Uh, so, I've got to see what else I can entail for Christmas now. Perhaps a new big lathe. You never know. So, what we're going to do now, we'll put a block of wood on it. And then we'll have a look how it performs. Right, we're ready to do a few little tests. Let's get it around and do a few little bits and bobs just to see how it performs. Don't forget. Safety first.
Yes, I performed quite well. Soon got it to run. I know it helps if you've got sharp chisel. Right then, let's. Don't seem to be losing speed as I'm doing it. So we'll uh, let's throw a couple of. Uh, couple of shafts in it. Let's see what happens then. It's getting a bit closer. I'm quite impressed with it. Let's play a bit more. Absolutely magic. Well impressed with it. Like I says for what I want it for, for well just for pen blanks or things like this, you know, or it's a, it's ideal. Uh, so I'm really over the moon. I'm not gonna say anything bad about it because up to here I'm quite chuffed with it. So we'll see how we go over the next couple of weeks and I think the next video I'll do, I might uh, do a little jewellery box on here or something or a pen, could do with a pen or in fact I've got some, some acrylic uh, pen blanks so I might actually do these on for the next project if you're, you know, if you're interested or perhaps do that, we'll, we'll see. So hopefully can start to get a bit more time in the uh, workshop now so uh, that's my review on this lathe now I hope I've explained enough about the lathe uh, to be honest with you I've, I've never done a review before uh, so I hope I've explained enough on it 
the Freddy's it's three four summer sixteen TPI. It's a TM one for them to fit into. As you can see there. As you can see that all down there. So there you go. I like that. Tighten that, that, that don't seem to me, so I'm quite chuffed with that. Let's see after using it whether it still lines up quite well. Yeah, it's quite good. So there you are. The dry pack mini lathe. £170 delivered to your door. I'm lucky, obviously, it was bought off my two daughters as a Christmas. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I'm thinking of Christmas already, as my birthday, so the one inch came true, so I'm going to have a think about Christmas now, see what I can get off on me. Right then, so that is the uh, mini, the dry pack mini lathe, uh, variable speed, uh, it's a nice soft start, that's what I do like about that lathe, you press the button as you've seen it, uh, slowly built up and yeah, uh, I'm really chuffed with it. Chuffed with it. Uh, really built, uh, well built, and it'll be ideal for, uh, like I say, for pens and small boxes and stuff like that. So I'm excited to start giving it a go. Uh, we'll do a couple of pens on it, and uh, I'll keep you informed on it. But you will be seeing that live in future videos. Um, so for this week, uh, till next time, speak to you soon. Bye now.